is putting chili. I'm gonna make a chili burger, but first I'm gonna take the cheese. I'm putting two slices of cheese because that cheese is amazing. So I'm gonna put the chili on. Like so. Just a little bit there. And then I'm gonna put the cheese on top of that. And then I'm gonna take that burger we just made. And put more chili on. Okay. And then I'm gonna put the cheese on top of that again. <laughs> there, like that. I have some fries. And these are my potato, sweet potato fries. There we go. Everything in there, okay, good. And that is gonna be my meal. You have to taste it. Oh yeah, okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to prepare uh, a venison hamburger. venison hamburger I've got all the ingredients ready to go I've got the, the venison one pound of venison I've got one egg white to hold the uh, meat together I have salt pepper onion powder uh, garlic powder uh, in here and I'll put the all the ingredients down below in the um, description. I'm going to grate a little bit of, of butter, frozen butter, along with the egg whites in the meat as well. That way it holds it because the meat is very lean. It may not stick together if I don't do that. So I'm going to do that. And I have balsamic vinegar and Worcestershire sauce here. Like again, I'll put the amounts and the ingredients in the description below. I think we're ready to go. Um, going to be reading uh, the directions and let's see what we have to do. So I put the butter in the freezer so I can grade that and um, we're going to heat the stove up. So I want to put the stove up and then I'm going to use a cast iron skillet uh, to cook uh, the hamburgers in here. Okay, so I'm going to be cooking the hamburgers uh, in the iron skillet. So the first thing we have to do is warm the stove up, which I started to do. And um, it's going to tell me next thing I need to do is uh, mix all the ingredients together. And I'll put the butter in last. Uh, so I'm going to be using my hands and a, maybe a fork and let's put all the ingredients together now. So basically I've got the, uh, hamburger there and I'm going to put the Worcestershire sauce in and then I'm going to put the powdered ingredients, which is the salt, pepper, onion powder and garlic powder. I'm going to put all that on. Okay. And then I'm going to put the one egg yolk, the one egg yolk. Uh, it's going to go also in like that. Okay. And then we're going to mix. And I'm going to leave the water running here so I can rinse my hands out real quick. So Let's mix this together with all those ingredients. Okay. 
This is, again, venison burger. Uh, I did not buy the, the venison burger. This was uh, a fresh hunt. So this venison is going to be a local venison shot right here in uh, Georgia. Uh, just mixing this up real good using one hand that way I can have one clean hand. It's not going to take very long to put all this together. While I'm doing this, uh, make sure that uh, you're following my channel. If you're not following my channel, then please put in the comments below uh, what I need to do so that you will follow my channel. And then also in the comments, if you have a change in this recipe or any of the recipes that I make, let me know because I want to try it. I also, when I was getting the ingredients for this, <laughs> I bought more ingredients for the uh, Mexican uh, cornbread because that cornbread, it was amazing. It was really, really good. So let's put this in like that. I think this is pretty much mixed. So what I have to do now, wash my hands real quick. And then I have to put the butter. So I have a frozen butter here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grate it real quick. Like this. I grate this butter real fast. Don't need a lot because I don't want it greasy, but that's plenty right there. Put this back. in the freezer so I can use it again. And then we're going to mix. And then after we mix, we're going to make the patties. I don't know how much you can see, but I hope I position those cameras in the right place. I'm going to make these burgers, but I'm gonna eat them different ways. I'm gonna eat the burger also with uh, uh, like a chili burger. I'm gonna try one just regular like this and then I'm gonna also make one. Uh, let's see, make sure that's hot. And we're gonna just patty these up. Just gonna patty them up and hopefully I did a good job. It's the first time I've made these burgers. So let's hope I do it correctly. But we'll see together. But I'm sure it would be just fine. Looks good so far. The patty's coming out fine. So I'm just gonna keep making it so it's round like the so. And then put that on the burner. I'm very excited to get these burgers. I've been wanting to do this and I wanted to do it for you guys as well, because I don't know um, that a lot of people know how to make venison burger or even how to eat venison burgers. And then like I said, the reason I put the egg in there, as you can see, it's very, it's very lean, so you have to put uh, the the uh, butter and the 
and the egg to help hold it together. I, I just hope it doesn't fall apart because I'm actually following directions also. But we'll see. It said four burgers, but I think I'm gonna have more. <laughs> takes time to shape these proper for me I'm sure so those of you watching are much better at this than I am it would take you less time but for me it is I, think I can make one more here and then I'm gonna have to do this in shifts which I didn't want to do, so I'm going to have to get another pan. Let's turn this on. Yeah, I have to get another pan because that is only five there. So for the pan, need as big a pan there. But you know, maybe I could just put one burger here. This would be a, just a real big burger here. I know you can't smell it, but um, actually I think the smell is very good. Okay, so now this burger is ready. Flip them over one more time. Yeah, like that. That looks so good, doesn't it? And you know, it turned out I was worried it was gonna break up, but it did not break very badly. That's me dripping on the uh, oil on the stove. Turn the stove off. And we're going to use probably this one here because it's cooked really well. I'm gonna use that one on this burger, so yeah, let's do that. Let's put this on top of the lettuce like so. And then the cheese on top and there's the burger now where's my fries right oh my god I cooked that too fast so I'm gonna have to show you the french fries in the next video because they are gonna be good and they'll be with my next burger but for now I want to continue on with my venison burger and doesn't it look good yeah so let's cut it and let's take a look and see how it looks when it's cut okay so we're going to cut this burger all right like that Okay, and there it is. I'll show you in this way as well. You can see the steam still coming up like that. So let's hope it's cooked all the way through. I think it is. Wow, that's it right here. This is awesome. It turned out wonderful. Stay tuned so I can show you more. Hmm.
so I can show you much more. That was fun. No. Let me prepare for the next video. Take care. Please like it. It helps everyone else find my channel. Until then, until I get a bunch of likes, a bunch of subscribes, and a bunch of comments. And trust me, when you comment, I comment back. When I get those, I'll be able to make more and more and more and more. So like, share, subscribe. Check out my description. I have other links on there. I'll be putting the recipe that I just did here also in the description. Until next time, bye guys. <laughs> Should be almost done. Getting more and more excited. Again, uh, if you have any comments about what I'm doing and how I'm doing it, please put them down below and let me know because I can't wait to try your recipe. Uh, and I will try your recipe. And also make other comments on other things you would like me to do, whether it be cooking, uh, travel here in North Georgia. Uh, the weather is getting better, so I'm going to start taking you guys out on my motorcycle. And by the way, I belong to a motorcycle club. So I'm going to be taking you out on the motorcycles. I'm going to uh, hopefully find some more waterfalls in the area. And... Also going to be interviewing more with my fiance who's in the Philippines. She's waiting for this video to get done as well so she can uh, watch. She can't wait to try. So that's going to be exciting. So I'm going to turn this off now. And I'm going to put that patty in here with the others because now that they have shrunk, I can put that in here.